check this out. This oyster, which I found in the North Atlantic, is eating this oyster. And inside of that oyster right there, it's got something, a pearl. I don't know, I have no idea. These are the ones that have come in. They've taken months to get here, but these are the new ones. So all of these oysters underneath of here have an oyster from far away land. And what's inside of here, I don't know. Now, check out, this is a real oyster and he doesn't, he's, he left a shell but he doesn't have any pearls, right? Or anything, but he's beautiful. And I found him, okay? I found him when I was on my vacation up in the island in the North Atlantic. So, this oyster though, this oyster came from a very far away land where they grow different kinds of things and different stuff. Uh, they do uh, pearl farming and all that. So the oysters make the pearls and then I open them up. Oh, it got holographic nail polish. Check out that ring. Isn't it cool? Does anybody know what it is? And check out this ring. Is that a mood ring? Remember that? Nah, it's not a mood ring. It's something. But it's some kind of stone. I bought it from an artiste or an artist. So let's see what kind of pearl, or let's see what's inside of here, right? <gasps> I don't know, I see something. I see something, I see something, right? Ouch. Let's see, you see it in there? There's a pearl in there, or there's something in there. I don't wanna move all these. Every single one of them is so different, but I kinda need to push it down and I need to push it open. Try to open it up. Here we go. And here's our first pearl inside of, ooh, this oyster. So we have, it's a double, beautiful double, double bubble. Well, this is a, I forgot the name of this one, but this is something really pretty, right? Look at that, look at that pearl. So that oyster made that pearl. So now we're gonna go on to another oyster here on our table. Isn't that cool? There's these oysters, <laughs> there's these oysters. I'm gonna have like oysters everywhere. So let's open up, let's do this one back here. This one was cool. When I opened, when I picked this one up in the ocean, isn't it pretty? See all the different lines on it? It's so thick because it's been in the ocean for so long. You know, oysters clean the ocean, you guys, just so you know that. Now, underneath that oyster is this oyster. Oyster, what do you have? That's what you have to ask yourself. I think it's beautiful. Look at the seashell, isn't it pretty? It's so cool. It looks like very um, volcanic looking. I have to figure out what all the lines are. So. Yay, she went back to doing oyster openings. Of course I did. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? <laughs> if I start opening up and doing something else, nobody watches. If I do this, everybody watches. So just watch my show and just keep watching because you never know what I'm going to do. All right, so let's do this. So we're going to open up this oyster. Let's see what this oyster made. Now this oyster has what? Do you see anything? Do you see any? Ooh, what's this? Ooh, ooh, ooh. This oyster, ooh. <gasps> ooh, look at this. Ooh, ooh, look at this. This oyster has a beautiful sapphire gemstone in it. Whoa, that guy gets almost as big as the one on my finger. It's actually bigger, right? Look at that. That is so cool. Oysters and gemstones. How could that possibly happen? Wait a minute. You mean to tell me you found this in the ocean and then these came in and they grew a gemstone? Uh, basically, yeah. So um, I hope you like my show. So look at this. 
I wonder how much this is worth. I don't know, but it's beautiful, right? Now, let's go on. That was in this oyster. Well, why don't we take this oyster here and we'll put the gem and we'll put this inside of it. Oh, look at that. You know, I like the camera too now because I'm using my iPhone. It's so much better. Okay, so now let's examine another kind of oyster. What kind of oyster is this? Why are there all these holes all over the oyster? Does anybody know? What is it? It's like it's on the moon. Do you have a pearl? No. Just, I think it's been in the water for a really long time. This one I found in the pond. Uh, it's a pond, they're, they're great ponds on the island. So here's his oyster. What we're gonna find. So remember, this one I found, this is the shell, and this is the one that came from a faraway land. Okay, so let's open up this oyster. I got a lot. I'm lucky today, everybody. The most fascinating show on YouTube possible, right? Please subscribe to my channel and like my videos and share them because you know why? <laughs> They're kind of funny and um, well, then again, you're watching Funhouse. So let's see what's inside of this oyster. Nope, nothing. Anything? Mm, the paper's moving. The paper is moving. What's inside? Ooh, ooh, look at this. Ooh, look at this pearl. Ooh, what is this? Look at this pearl. Ooh, that's like the color of my nail polish. Look at that. That's beautiful. Look at that. Ooh, I like that. Check that out. We're finding big pearls today. Looks like it's gonna be a golden day. So we have lots of different kinds of shells, oysters eating oysters, and I can't believe the size of this one, but we'll get to that one in a minute. So now we have this oyster. Oyster, what do you have? Nothing. What's this spot here? Does anybody know? Look at the shell. Does anybody know how seashells form? Anybody wanna learn about it? Oh wait, I do. Maybe I just become the oyster television and change my channel to oyster TV, right? Why not? Nobody else is. Okay, so let's do this. When I was little, I wanted to grow up and be an oceanographer and learn all about the ocean and what was in it. But then I decided to go do other fun things. So now I'm an oceanographer. I'll be the oceanographer of YouTube learning why, what these are, and seeing if people actually wanna do this. Watch this, so here we have, oh, look at this one. Look at the size of this pearl. <gasps> look at this, you guys, that's so cool. We have, this is so cool, so we found, wow, that's a huge pearl. That, it like weighs a lot, it weighs almost as much as my ring. Which, by the way, these rings, they're like some stones, and they are pretty expensive, but not as expensive as something else that I bought. If you wanna know what my expensive gift I bought when I was away, uh, comment below. Oh, by the way, you guys, my birthday was September 10th. Happy birthday, Steph, right? <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna open, we have two choices here. Now, why is this shell, which one do you wanna look at? This one, this one, or this one? I think we should go for this one. Now, this shell has a lot of white in it, but it also has a lot of black in it, okay? Now, I was actually reading about shells and why some of them are black. It's because they're like hundreds, maybe even thousands of years old. I mean, look how long it's been in the ocean, and now it's on Funhouse TV. It's like perfect. Look at that. It's like one year, two year. We're gonna figure this out. We'll get to the bottom of it, but apparently the blackness is because they've been buried for so long and then they dig them up. Now, this one doesn't have an oyster, but it has an oyster over here. So let's open up this one. Okay. 
What kind of pearl do you think we're gonna find? What kind of pearl do you think you're gonna find? I don't know. Oh, what did we find? We found, ooh, a beautiful gemstone. <gasps> Look at this one. This one's different. This one, oh, this one's like the color of my nail polish. Oysters don't make gemstones that are perfectly faceted. Um, yes, they do. Oysters can make anything. I don't know what they can make. They actually can make anything, but then again, you're watching my show, so who cares what they can make? All this stuff is real. Nothing is your imagination and you're not losing your mind. Just you're watching my show. So something's burning. What the heck? I'm losing my mind right now because somebody's cooking something outside. So we have this beautiful gem. Look how pretty that is. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh, I'd like to give a shout out to a lot of shout out outers. Carmen and Sue and everybody who watches my show and Christy and Billy and Tommy and I don't know, Land, everybody, Landon, shout outs. Now look at the size of this oyster. Did I find this oyster? Is this the biggest oyster I've ever found? No, I didn't find this oyster. My friend Stacy found this oyster and I was like, oh my God, that's gigantic. It weighs a ton. This weighs like probably a pound. Do you believe the size of the oyster, like what it would have in here? It doesn't have anything, but look at all of this. We have to learn about what all this stuff is because every oyster has this thing. And I want to know why. But oysters clean the ocean, just so you know that they get rid of all the pollutions and things that are in there. So there we go. So we have this, and now we have our last and final oyster for the day, which is this, and we're gonna say, Oyster, what do you have? Oh, by the way, that's my line, and don't have any of these other bonehead uh, YouTubers take my Oyster, what do you have, right? There you go. Ow. I don't know what's in here. Ooh, what do you see? What do you see, what do you see? All right, I see a giant, humongous, teardrop-looking pearl. Now look at that. You guys, these are freshwater pearls, and these are priceless gemstones, okay? How they get in the oysters, I don't know. All I know is this, is that you're watching my show because you're interested in stuff that's super cool and amazing to view. So... Which was your favorite oyster? This big one? Do you think there's a bigger one than this? Do you think I might have found the world's biggest oyster? Coming up next, let's figure it out. There might be another oyster that's actually bigger than this. Check out my show. Remember to subscribe and be a game changer, okay? And please, I wanna to get to a million subscribers. Make a wish, watch my other videos. I uploaded three videos yesterday and like thing. And it's like, they're not like putting my videos out. Losers. Okay, later.